Hey everybody, Kyra091 hanging out with your boy. Oh boy, are we gonna have big fun today playing <laughs> yeah, and Apocalypse 2012 sends a message that says, Boy oh boy, we're going to have big fun today. Alright. Um anyways guys, uh well, playing I'm at the Hill Giants, so I'm not gonna be in this episode like every else episode that we recorded. Um, he's fighting hill giants. He's not. He doesn't have time for us today, guys. Uh, so what we are gonna do is playing the city. Is we're gonna try to do a quest today. We're gonna do uh, the plague city quest. It's a really short. Trust me. Oh, oh, you want to play? Uh, which uh, starts here in East or East Ordoin in the northwest corner of East Ordoin, right here, which is quest start. And, and Kyrie, he wanted to teleport to castle walls when uh, I told him that the quest is like a bug. Yo, you, you need 32 agility to get, but your, your crowfoot just slowing down and you use it. Yeah, I'll, I'll just use that bridge. I, I, I can't use an agility shortcut that would cross that little the little river uh, to get over there, but I don't have high enough agility. It's this little log right here, so even if I tried to use this log, it's going to tell me no. 33 agility to get across. That's fine. We'll just click over here and I'll let my little army man here trot across like that because he's an army man, so. I have my uh, Varrock or my uh, Falador shield that restores my prayer points. That's kind of cool, huh? And I have the one that I could use to do um, refill my run points too, so that's kind of neat. In fact, I'll probably end up using the run point thing today at some point here. Uh, Alright, so this is, I think, where we're headed over here to start the quest. Uh, using the, like, the back oh, yeah, that's this it. guy. So we're going to talk to Edmund. And he's going to give us some idea for what we're up against here. Sorry, I can't stop to talk. What's wrong? Got to find my daughter. I pray she's still alive. What happened to her? Ellen is a healer. Three weeks ago, she managed to cross the wall into West Erdoin. No one's allowed to cross the wall. Plague. Not that long ago, West Erdoin was hit by a deadly plague. Not unlike the coronavirus. They had a wall built up to try to keep it contained. No one's allowed to enter the city. They say the plague is a horrible way to go. Ellen had to go help. Said be, she'd be gone for a few days, but we heard nothing since. Maybe I can help find her? Really, would you? I've been working on a plan to get into West Ordon, but I'm too old and tired to carry it through. You, on the other hand, you should have no problem. Sure. Where should I start? If you're going into West Ordon, you'll need protection. My wife made a special gas mask for Elena with dwellberries rubbed into it. They repel the plague, apparently. We need some more, though. Where can I find dwellberries? MacGruber's Wood, West of Sears Village. Okay, so I already brought some dwell berries with me, so I'm ready to go. You actually need chocolate dust. I, I can, I, I have chocolate and I have a pestle and mortar. I can make chocolate dust. So is the wife in here? Yes. She the one that's gonna give me the. Uh, oh wait, wait! Before you go talk to the wife, uh, fill up your your buckets. Uh, oh, at the sink. Yeah. How many buckets of water am I gonna need? Is it gonna? Okay, that's fine. You, you need a bucket of milk. I know it's okay. I can empty the bucket of water if I need to. You only need four. Okay, so I got my four Take buckets that of water. Huh? Uh, ugly picture. Take it. Yes. Oh, is that the picture of the daughter? Yeah. She's not ugly. It's a very nice picture. Yo, wait till you do buy your house. She looks ugly. Okay, so let's talk to this person here. Edmund has asked me to help you find your daughter. I began making your special gas mask, but I need some dwell berries. I got some right here. You guys can see I already the have this. The first thing you do is put the dwell berries on. I mean, okay, not the dwell so berries, and put the mask You on. must wear this mask or you could catch the plague. It gives me a gas mask. I'll make a spare mask for you in case you lose that one. I'll hide it in the cupboard case in, ca in case the mortars come with Alright, so we got the mask. I guess we can now head into... Wait, is there a cow farm nearby? Kyrie. What? No. Lumbridge. There's other ones too, but yes, there is one in Lumbridge. I was just hoping there was one nearby because I know I'm going to need a bucket of milk and I was kind of hoping to have that before I leave. Um, okay, I'm in Lumbridge real quick just to fill up uh, my bucket of milk from the cow. Yeah, but you have to teleport to the village in here because guys, remember, if you want to teleport to our door and you, if you want to use the teletop or use the magic, you have to finish playing city. Look at all these goblins right here that you can fight. This is such a good place to level up when you're a lobby. 
Look at all these. Like, you would always have guys to kill if you're like a low combat level. This is a place to be, this but goblin me, field right here. But me and Kai, we roll like in the 60s. Yeah, it would so. be kind of pointless because those guys only have 5 HP. Okay, so we got dairy cows right here. So we can go to milk dairy cow and we should end up with a bucket of milk. We usually fight like moss giants or real giants. There we go, got a bucket of milk. Okay, so I'm going to use this thing to get back to the ranging guild. Don't go to anywhere else because the monster we is by Edril. Oh, I'm, yeah, I know where the monastery is. It's like, yeah, I know. It's kind of by Black Knight's Fortress, huh? Like the Ice Wolf no, Mountain? No, it's by Edril. Yeah, it's just by Edril. Okay, so. And uh, Neville teleports to the champion skill because it's in Balrog. Everybody knows that they do dragon skill. Oh, yeah. Alright, so we're going to head into, I guess, through right here at the gate to no, West Ardoin. No, you do not do that, but you don't even have to do that in this quest. Okay, so let's see what... What, what quest am I... Plague City. <laughs> okay, I need to talk to Edmund about getting into West Ardoin. So let's go talk to Edmund and see what his ideas are. Alright, let's talk to Edmund and figure out how we're going to get into... That's how you get it. Let's see what he's got to say. Got the gas mask. Beneath us are the Ardoin sewers. I believe you can use them to... I've already tried digging down, but the soil is rock hard. You'll need to pour several buckets of water. Four buckets should do it. Okay. Put on the gas mask and you'll die in sewers. Alright, so where do I need to dump this water? Uh, it's some real... You see those, like, empty patches and no, like, stuff? Yeah. You could put bottles in either of those. Looks like someone's tried digging here. You need to put the water. Okay. I relax. All right. Soil softened slightly, so let's keep dumping water on this mud patch, I guess. All right. Now it's soft enough to dig, so let's dig. Why not? Because you need to listen to me, because I did this quest. I understand, but I also want to know why I'm doing this. I don't just want to know what to click on. Look, go straight, go straight until you see a dead end. That way? Yes. Click, click right there, like, in front of that water source. Not, like, in front, like, yeah. And then, uh, make your character, like, pull him back, because that leads to the all door. That was just, like, Okay. Else. It's too secure. You can't pull it off alone. Go talk to Edmund. Wait, put a rope for us, because everyone else like, put a rope. Put a rope on what? That pipe that you tried to open. Like, ooh, ooh. But if you have a rope for everyone, there's a like, I found a pipe. There's a grill. I might be able to use some rope to Thanks. pull it off. So we got a rope we're going to use on the grill. I had a bunch of rope from when I wanted to go down into that uh, the sewer or the thing. Okay, so... Now go talk to Edmund, because he needs some help you. All right, let's talk to Edmund. <laughs> Look at my face with the mask on. All right, let's get Edmund doesn't have a mask on. Oh, he's not going into the Ardoin with me, though. He's just going to help pull this thing off. Hey, we got it. Look for a man called Jethric. He's an old friend of the family. Jethric. Hopefully, he can help you. All right, got it. Now you're supposed to like go in to go to West Ardoin. You climb through the sewer pipe. This is kind of gross. Oh no, guys! A man came through the sewers. Everybody, get inside! I'm just kidding. Now, Joe, pick a seal light. Okay, so we're looking for Jethic, who is apparently to the right. And I think that's him. That's just as a man. Is that him? No. Oh, there's Jethic right there. We don't get many newcomers around here. How come? Plague, of course. You'll find that all you'll find here is dead and dying. Your king, King Tyrus of West Ardoin. Okay. Guys, so where is the king? He's always been a bit of an explorer. Guys, you won't believe how much damage I just did to the snow dragon. King didn't care. He lived on another expedition. He hasn't been seen since. What brings you to... Oh, okay. Let's see here. 
Not many come here, although the name is familiar, what does she look like? I'll show him the picture. She came over here to help the plague victims. I think she's staying with the Renaissance family. Live in a small timbered building at the far north side of town. I've not seen her in a while, mine. Don't suppose you could run a little errand. I borrowed this book from them. Can you return it? I guess so, yeah. Go up. We'll have to do nothing. Go up. And then go to the left. Well, use, use cardinal directions, man. North, south, east, west. All right. So somewhere in this part of town, according to Jethic, somewhere in this part of town is where that family lives. And he said he saw Elena with them at some point. Let's see if this is a sad song. Hello there. Oh, well, that was dumb. All right. place. Is there anyone in here? Nope, I guess not. So this isn't the place. There's this little dungeon over here, but I don't want to go over there yet. I'm looking for this girl still. You notice there's really not a lot going on in West Ardoin. It's not like he started doing with like a bunch of shops and stuff. Busy day. Oh, the cat, they're hard to come by. Ah, oh, you don't see too many around. Well, I guess if I ever find a cat, I should bring him to this guy. Man. Which one of these freaking houses does this person live in? Um, honestly, guys, it it could be like any one of these places. There's an anvil in here. Huh, that's interesting. It's just an empty like blacksmith shop, I guess. Where are you, Elena? I'm trying to help you. Don't you want to be helped? More. All right, let's keep looking. Got to be one of these houses. Oh, this one looks unique. Oh, Renison, that's it. Go away. We don't want any. Come to return a book. Oh, why didn't you say come in then? Thank you missing that. Okay, so where is the girl? But a woman called Elena. She was, but over a week ago she's getting ready to go back. She never managed to leave. Uh, Millie was playing near the west wall when some shadowy figures jumped out to grab her. Millie's upstairs if you wish to speak, speak to her. Okay, so let's go upstairs and talk to the kid. Alright, Millie. Uh, I was at the southeast corner when I saw Elena walking by his butt. They... Okay, what building? It's the boarded up building with no windows in the southeast corner of West Ardoin. Okay. Well, there you go. So that's our next destination, I guess. It's going to be the southeast corner of this place. Let's take a look at the map. I'm guessing it's going to be this building right here, southeast corner, she says. So let's head down that way now. Oh my gosh, go. <laughs> let's use this thing. I got the ability to refill my run. I might as well do it. Huh? Okay, so this looks like the southeast corner. There's nothing in here. Let's see what... Southeast corner. I should go there and see if I can get into the house. I'm guessing this isn't it then because I got in here very easily. This must be it. The door won't open. You notice a black cross on the door. The black cross means the house has been touched by the plague. 
I, there's a kidnap victim in here. Kidnappers won't go in there. If someone's in there, they're probably dead by now. I want to check anyway. You don't have clearance to go in there. How do I get clearance? You need to apply to the head mourner or Bravik the city warder. Let me get your hopes up, though. What are they talking about? Okay, let's see. Okay, I was denied entry. I need clearance from the head mourner or Bravik the city warder. Okay, so how do I get approval from either one of those dorks? Let's see, they said the main... Is there like a downtown of <laughs> West, West Ordoin? Because they were saying that like it's br that Bravik guy who's like the, the head guy. Oh, there's the head mourner. I need uh, to enter a plague house. Uh, there's a kid, kidnap victim inside. It's good as dead. No point in trying to save him. Um, not good enough. Looking for a woman named Elena. I've heard of her. A healer, I believe. She must be mad coming over. Probably caught the plague. Very tragic. Stupid waste of life. Ah, uh, you're not being very helpful, head mourner. You must be nuts. Absolutely not. Yes, I'm utterly crazy. Oh, boy. This guy's a pain in the butt. No, we already tried that. Let's try again. Okay, so the only thing we haven't said is I've got a gas mask. How do I get trained? Oh boy. Uh, the head mourner does not seem like he's going to be very helpful. Let's see if we can find that other guy, that, that Bravik guy. So this, this is where we first came in. This is like the closest thing to a like community area that I can think of would be this big building here. So maybe Bravik is in here. Clerk. Oh, there he is, Bravik. I was talking to him. Go away, I'm busy. I'm in a meeting. All right, so Bravik won't let us in. Let's talk to this clerk guy. I need permission to enter a plague house. Okay. I already talked to those guys. It didn't work. Can I speak to Bravik anyway? He is asked not to be disturbed. This is urgent, though. Someone's been kidnapped. I'll see what I can do, I suppose. Mr. Bravik, this man here really needs to speak with you. If they can keep it short, they can come in. Okay, so let's go in here and talk to this guy, Bravik. Hope I don't screw it up. This is really important, though. Oh, boy. <laughs> Do you know what's in the cure? He wants a hangover cure. A tatty piece of paper. Let's take a look at the paper from Bra Bravik. Where is it? Read scruffy note. Bucket of milk. Grind some chocolate with pestle and mortar. Add the ground chocolate to the milk. Finally, add some snape grass. Well, I have all that with me. Let's go ahead and use the chocolate bar and the pestle and mortar. We now have chocolate dust. We're gonna add that to a bucket of milk. We now have some delicious chocolate milk. But the last ingredient was snape grass. We're gonna add that to it. And we now have hangover cure, which we are going to, I guess we'll try to use it on Bravik. Oh boy. Try this, so let's give him the hangover cure. Oh, it's much better. What did you, okay. Uh, being held in the plague house. The mourners deal with that sort of thing. They won't listen to me. I already tried talking to the head mourner. They say I'm not properly equipped, even though I do have a very effective gas mask. They go a bit far. I've heard of Elena. She's helped us a lot. I'll give you this warrant to enter the house. Awesome. So now we can get inside the plague house, thanks to our hangover cure and this piece of paper, I guess. Is this it? Scruffy note. Where? Oh, there it is. Warrant. Okay. So let's go back down to the plague house where uh, where we believe we'll be able to find Elena. And let's go open the door. No, I have a warrant from Bravik to enter, so shut up. <laughs> ah, well, it was backwards turn. We went ahead and snuck right on in. All right, let's find Elena. Is that her? That's her. 
Can I open the door? Is it going to be that easy? Yeah, I didn't think so. Uh, I would, but I don't have a key. I'm sure I heard them stashing it. I'll look for it. Okay, is it in this crate? No. Is it... What can I even interact with down here? Maybe it's upstairs. Let's look around on some of these places. Like, uh, these boxes. Or something. Maybe it's in that barrel? Oh, I found a small key in the barrel. Alright, let's go back downstairs. Now we can open the door. You unlock the door. Alright, let's talk to her. Kidnap being so inconvenient. I was on my way to diagnose a cure. We can leave via the manhole in the middle of the city. Go see my father. I'm sure Mel make sure he adequately rewards you. I better leave while I still can. Okay. So Elena's gone, and now all that's left to do, I guess, is to go back through the sewer and go talk to the the dad over there. So I guess I will meet you guys on the other side here. Okay, so let's talk to Edmund and see what he thinks. Uh, what can I give you? Keep this magic scroll. He gave me a magic scroll. Oh, it's a teleport scroll. And I got a little mining experience. That'll probably actually level me, I think, because I was really close to leveling. Recommend you go see Elena. She'll want to thank you. She lives in the house opposite ours. Mining level 66. <laughs> okay, I'm not going to talk to her yet. Um, guys, that's going to do it for this episode. Be sure to join us next time for more Let's Play Old School RuneScape. We went ahead and finished up Plague City. So, there we go. Oh, can I read this scroll right now? You can now use the Ardoin Teleport. Oh, I can. Let's try it out. Oh, two Law Runes, though. I'll try it anyways. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> oh, no. I was about to get a cool random event, and I disappeared. <laughs> Alright, guys. Um, I think I can do thieving right here in this these these places. Yeah, can I steal from this this stall? I'm gonna try it. You need level 20. Okay. Well, uh, that's gonna be it, guys. Kyrie 91 reminding you have your pets spayed and neutered. Control the pet population. Do the right thing. Um, onions, spice, and a knife. Oh, that garlic. I mean. All right, bye everyone. Yep. Hey everybody, this is Kyrie091. If you enjoyed this video, or maybe you just like the sound of my voice like I do, consider subscribing to the Kyrie channel for more big fun.